The overall goal of this structure function method is to dissect at the molecular level the role of different protein domains or disease-relevant mutations in naive or differentiated mouse embryonic stem cells. This method can help to reveal how different residues or domains of a protein can contribute to its function in a given cellular context. The main advantage of this technique is that it allows very efficient targeting of rescue constructs to the genome of knockout embryonic stem cells, or ESLs, and the investigation of their role in different cell types. To achieve this, we combine three highly efficient technologies. These include improved mouse embryonic stem cell isolation, recombination-based targeting vector assembly, and ESL targeting via recombination-mediated cassette exchange, or RMC. Demonstrating some of the procedures will be Yinke Dont, a technician from my laboratory. Recombination-mediated cassette exchange, or RMCE, allows the interchange of DNA fragments between a vector and a genomic locus. RMCE takes advantage of heterospecific recombination sites that do not cross-react and that are embedded in a genomic locus. In the presence of a donor plasmid that contains a DNA fragment flanked by the same heterospecific sites, the recombinase will insert this DNA fragment into the RMCE-compatible genomic locus because of double simultaneous translocation. Only upon correct recombination, the trapped promoterless neomycin resistance gene in the ROSA26 docking site will be restored via a PGK promoter. In